This is an emotional remembrance of a song that was born in the 60s, actually around 1967, a song that was very popular and woke us all up because the music and the lyrics were out of this world. It was an experience for all of us. A whiter shade of pale. We skipped the light fandango, turned curved wheels across the floor. I was feeling kind of seasick. The crowd called out for more. The room was humming harder as the ceiling flew away when we called out for another drink the waiter brought a tray and so it was that later as the miller told his tale that her face at first just ghostly turned a whiter shade of pale. The song was a masterpiece, still is. It is an anthem of the late 60s, a song that brings many memories for the young of those days. A phenomenal song, a whiter shade of pale. She said, there is no reason. And the truth is plain to see. But I wandered through my playing cards and would not let her be. One of sixteen Vestal virgins who were living for the coast and although my eyes were open they might just as well be closed and so it was that later, as the miller told his tale, that her face at first just ghostly turned a whiter shade of pale. The song was written by two members of the group while working together for Procul Harum, the name of the group. The melody came out for a piece from Johann Sebastian Bach. The, the music is not a copy of Sebastian Bach, not a copy at all, but much influenced by the genius of the historic composer. Gary Brooker, and Matthew Fisher were fine musicians ready and waiting for the lyrics for the melody they have just composed. They didn't have words for the music. Keith Stewart and Brian Reed, the other two components of the musical group, 
wrote the words on the song started to take shape. But it was the voice of Gary Brooker and the organ, the elements that happened to make a very special song out of a whiter shade of pale. Procol Harum, the name of the group, in May of 1967, stunned the musical world with this new song that became a hit in Europe and the US and the rest of the world. It's funny to say that on paper, the way the lyrics were written did not make much sense to anybody, except the writers of the song. But the music was outstanding, and when put together in the recording studio, magic happens. The combination of the music and the lyrics did it all. A whiter shade of pale is a song after so many years. A song to be reckoned with. My name, Emiliano Martin, saying once again, thank you for your attention. And until next time, thank you.